6 million older adults suffer with the complications associated with dementia, with Alzheimer's disease accounting for 80% of these dementia cases. It's estimated that as many as 14 million Alzheimer's cases will be on the books by 2050, and there's no effective treatment for dementia, so we want to talk about prevention. Fitness and nutrition expert Mackie Shields told us here to discuss how a healthy lifestyle, including adding blueberries to your diet, may reduce the risk of cognitive decline with age. Mackie, we haven't had you in the studio in so long because of the pandemic. Well, April and I have been out in the world on different that. planets, and you know, they've been doing a great the job. producers like us out and about, but listen, I had to come back and I really had to dedicate this segment to um, Sheba. Mm. I mean, this is blueberries <laughs> reduce the risk <laughs> to dementia as you approach midlife. Do not so, come in this studio to fight with me. So this is for you. You're all right? ridiculous. And it's, it's, <laughs> it's very serious. We're going to prevent this for Sheba. I can't stand you. Well, here's the deal. <laughs> I'll take it from here, okay? Okay, great. Um, there really is no cure for dementia. And as Sheba said, 14 million by 2050 is estimated. But you have to start with your diet. And the Mediterranean diet, which I've talked about, this is my 25th year on the show. I've talked about it for half of that. It's been the subject of many of my books. That's an emphasis on lower red meat, chicken, fish, turkey, uh, fruits, um, um, a little bit of red wine, and uh, grains, and olive oil. But one of the keys is it reduces something called insulin resistance. And that's an issue where you're not responsive to your insulin, which is a very powerful hormone. As we get older, we tend to increase Sheba, that visceral fat around the waist. I was wondering if you were gonna put me okay. back in uh, our interview. Uh, okay, but anyway, so with that said, um, science is now looking at what berries may have an effect on the insulin inflammation in the body. So, uh, all research- All berries or just blueberries? Well, all berries, but we're gonna get to blueberries in a second, okay? Okay, got it. So, uh, scientists from, uh, from both Chicago, from uh, Cincinnati and Kentucky have found that berry fruit, there's your gross uh, m mixture of berries, uh, has the potential to produce varied health benefits. And you can see a reduction of inflammation, the oxidative stress, improved vascular function, and that neuronal signaling, that's the key. So what they decided to do was they did a 12-week study, and here's where it comes in, people 50 to 65 years of age. Got you're, it. You're approaching that. I'm already past <laughs> You know what? Oh, so I'm already past that. All Continue right? with and, the facts. Sir. And what they did was they did significant amount of testing, but what was interesting, people in the study uh, were in fact the ones that did have cognitive de decline. So what they did, you can see here, it demonstrated that when they gave them, and here's the key, I'll show you half a cup of blueberries a daily or a blueberry powder over 12 weeks produced measurable improvements in cognitive benefit. Uh, for the insulin resistance. Like in what ways? Like could they remember more things? Well, yes, but remember now, this is a half a cup of blueberries you're seeing that's right all? here. That's all? And that's that, all they ate a day? That, that, well, or they took, you can get blueberry powder. What about frozen blueberries? Well, you can do that too, as okay. long as it doesn't have sugar. That's a good point. Uh, I'm surprised you remembered that. You've been eating your blueberries. I have, frozen. So with the idea of what, what I'm really getting at, food is medicine, you can take back control. It's inexpensive, it's available everywhere. Half a cup is really nothing. You can put it in muffins, you can you can eat them with your yogurt, well, whatever. Well then maybe you. that'll be your next segment. We'll have you figure out some ways to help us eat blueberries. Thank you, Mackie, it's glad to have you back in the studio, despite you cutting up the entire interview. And we know the truth is you don't eat anything, so it's fine.